Hey, just a quick one here. Um, we had some issues with sewer smells coming back into um, our camper, but only when the air conditioning was running. And as an air conditioning guy, I can tell you that that makes absolutely no sense because your air conditioner doesn't draw air from outside. So I went up top and I uh, took this thing apart, make sure that there was no gaps in the sheet metal or anything inside of here that would allow this unit to suck uh, sewer gases in from that my Blackwater vent. Um, called the dealer. They were equally perplexed. They thought I had a toilet issue because uh, Domatech has a known issue with these uh, 300 series toilets. Uh, I took my toilet apart. Everything was bone dry inside. And I told them, I go, inside the bathroom is the best smelling place in there when we're running the air conditioner. Um, so what I did was I got up here one day and we're going to do my, my gray water tank because the black water is already done. And all you got to do is pull the lapping compound out of there then there's just a square head screw in there this just pulls off you might have to pull kind of tight because they're on these little fingers and what you can see i'll turn on my flash for you see that black pipe in there that's your abs pipe that goes all the way down to your gray tank and the other one goes all the way down to your black tank this gap right here goes underneath it just uh, this this just sits on top of your roof and then they screw it down then they put the lap and compound down they put the rubber right up to it so this is actually just plywood underneath that gap you can't really see it here but there's plywood under there and it's actually open to the framing of your roof and what I found was when I took down the indoor portion of my air conditioner, it's just framed in with a couple pieces of wood. The re and there's big gaps in there that are open to this space in here. So whenever the air conditioner ran, it would suck air from inside the camper, but it was also sucking air from inside the roof cavity and sucking air through this little tiny gap right there. Now, I thought to myself, there's absolutely no way that that's it. That's way too crazy of a situation um but what i did was I, I sealed it up with a little bit of uh thumb gum uh you could also use silicone or just regular caulk or anything like that and it took care of the problem so like i said i i'm gonna uh i'm gonna be doing the the gray water tank too just to uh foolproof it but if you guys ever come across some weird sewer smells uh that's that's what's going on Say hi, Logan. Hi. All right. Good luck.